The clink of glass bottles in the morning might be a distant memory for many, but that sound is becoming more common with the demand for glass bottles over plastic on the rise. It's a great job, you know, I mean, I was a mockman when I was 14. I come out rain, sleep, snow and everything else, so it's like I never miss a day. During his years in the milk float, or now van, Jim Giblin has seen customers' needs change. I was the only van down here and now we've got four vans. Um, but we have got a lot of customers now and what a massive change. You know, what a really good change. And it's we're just scratching the surface, but it's going to keep, it's going, we're going to get more and more and more. When Jim first started, he had 70 deliveries on his list. Now he can deliver to over 300 families in just one morning, and that number is set to go up. In the 1970s, most people got their milk delivered to their doors in glass bottles. But by the 90s, because it was cheaper and easier, many switched to plastic containers from supermarkets. But now the nostalgic, friendly neighbourhood milkman is back. McQueen's Dairies, based in Glasgow, is expanding in Galashiels to meet demand. We opened the Galashiels Depot uh, roughly a year ago now um, and we've been uh, growing quite rapidly throughout the borders and we plan to continue doing so over the next kind of year or two as well, showing plenty of demand for the, the service down that area, which is great for us. It's purely down to cut, cutting out the single-use plastic um, and everybody been keen to do what they can for the environment. It's industry standard, a glass bottle can be used up to 25 times before getting sent off for recycling. Two years ago we would be lucky if we were doing 10,000 glass bottles per week. This week we'll be doing more than 170,000 glass bottles. So it's increased you know, dramatically over two years. Thanks to families like the Rawsons who switched from plastic to glass to make breakfast times greener. I think we became really aware of the amount of milk that we were drinking and the amount of milk we were using um, at breakfast and cereal and we wanted to switch to a plastic free alternative. We've got rid of all the other drinks that we had previously in single use plastic bottles so getting rid of milk was, was a really obvious thing to try and do. And it's not just glass milk bottles as well, you've switched to other things from plastic to glass too haven't you? Yeah, I think as soon as you start thinking about what you do, um, you automatically think of alternatives for items that you use, particularly if you start to run out of something. Um, yeah. We've been making beeswax wraps to use as an alternative to cling film, um, or just recycling pots if things are coming in um, jars or containers. They might be slightly pricier, but for families like this one, ditching the plastic makes the prospect of buying milk easier to swallow. Jennifer Cordingly, ITV News, Gala Shields.